Hi everyone. Well, you know, for me anyway, Tuesday is no longer Monday's ugly sister. And it is no longer a Wednesday wannabe. It is now coming to its own. Tuesday is now Timu Tuesday. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited, not just because it's Timu Tuesday, it's because I get to talk to you guys. It means so much to me that you guys are able to take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means so much to me. I appreciate you guys so much. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel and you haven't had a second to subscribe yet, I hope you take a second right now. Click that little red subscribe button over there. I would love for you to come back and join us for future videos. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. And of course, I appreciate all your thumbs up. That really helps my channel grow as well. And yeah, your comments, of course, because, oh my God, these Timu Tuesdays, they have, or Timu any day, right? They are just taking off. So many people are enjoying the benefits of Timu and the wholesale prices and the quick deliveries and free deliveries and lightning deals. And even if it's not a lightning deal, the buys, the sales, so great. Having so much fun. Now that Kim from Hanging Out with Kim, I got her name right this time. I might say it again later and it'll be wrong, but I got it right once. So again, thank you so much, Kim, for letting me know about how to do that price reduction. Oh my gosh. It is just, I mean, sometimes it's only one to two cents, but you know what? It adds up. It puts credit back into your account. I mean, you can always put it back on your card or something like that. I just put it back onto my account at Timu and they just add up like that. So the next time I go to place an order, I've got some credits and that's really fun shopping, smart shopping. Rebates now with Rakuten Ebates, it's still right around 10%. Every now and then they do have specials where it went to 15 and 20, but at least it, lately it's been right at 10, pretty, pretty steady. So even if it goes down to one, two, 5%, it's just another great way to get some savings out of Timu and just getting things that maybe you need for your house, your backyard, the, I was gonna say the carnival, your garage, the backyard, maybe your camper, your boat, just, Halloween stuff is coming out with the fall decorations, Christmas decorations, just some fun, inexpensive things to kind of just brighten your mood, cheer up your house. And again, something for your pets, something for your children, something for teenagers or toddlers, for your husband. Mr. Mr. Griffin just came in. Yeah, so he's right there next to me. Yeah, so it's just toys for your puppies. Yeah, something for everyone. So anyway, just going to kind of quick get into it. I only picked a few things out to try to keep things moving fast. First thing I've got on, I've got this new hat on. Yeah, I wanted a baseball cap with bling. Never thought I would really like baseball caps, but after that 4th of July, I love that baseball cap. So this has got a little butterfly right here in gold. And then it's kind of, I don't know if that materials coming up but it's a nice white and it's kind of like um, embossed or something so it just kind of makes it a little bit more fancy it was four dollars and i think it was 94 cents i wrote it down four dollars 94 cents so again and it came packaged with everything else it had the little uh, plastic protector in just like the fourth of july hat and came just like this no issues with being it squished or anything so just loving it for four dollars and 94 cents I ended up getting another one of these little magnifiers for 68 cents. This one I'm leaving right in my kitchen drawer by the stove because every time you get something and you need the directions now, even though I've got my cheetahs on, I gotta go get this from my office or in the bedroom, I've got one in my nightstand now. So if I'm reading, I've got one right there if I need it. I've got one on the couch in case I'm happening to be reading on the couch. And of course I got the one in the office. So I got another one of these little magnifiers here for 68 cents, and that's going in the kitchen. Speaking of magnifiers, I got another one, which um, it's a different one. This one was $6.73. And so anyway, this one actually comes with a light. It came in a box. So it not only magnifies three times, it's got those kind of little flat batteries in here. So it lightens up. It's this little thing like this. 
It came with the batteries already in it. I don't know if this is gonna blind anybody. And a little rocker switch right here. And see if we can show what it looks like. So when you're reading at night, it's gonna brighten it up a little bit for you. So I thought this would help too on the book that I've got lately that's sometimes the, the printing is like more like a gray than a black and it makes it really hard to see. I thought this would make it really wonderful. And again, if anybody else has that trouble for $6.74, they did have some other ones. I think the magnification was all the same, but I could be wrong on that. And some were a little bit bigger. This one's just like the perfect size. Kind of keep it right there. And I got another ring, you know, uh, one of the other Timus ago, I got this, um, whoops, it goes one of my pearl, pearl earrings. Let me make sure the back, back is out. We'll leave that out. So anyway, they had another one that was a little bit different. So I got that as well. So we've got that one. So again, it's the black crystals and the regular crystals. This one looks like a knot. So just a fun little item to wear. You put it on this hand. And this one was a dollar thirty-four. So again, so I got two different ones, kind of like the same idea though. All right, so then I got another because I don't have a lot of red rings. So this one was a dollar thirty-four, and this one was called the Exaggerated Large Red Crystal Ring. And they have rings that take up like your whole hand here. I haven't I haven't gone that crazy yet. Not saying I'm not going to get it, but anyway, so just a nice pop of color right here with the red for a dollar thirty four and it was the same price as this one too so they were both a dollar thirty four next you know and I know Sue from hello superstar Sue she had mentioned purses and I do have some but you know I thought it would be fun to maybe get some dress purses from them so this one was really a great buy so this has got this little handle right here it's black it's beaded so that will go kind of like with my wine diary clothes and just kind of dressing up clothes it was fifteen dollars and 99 cents but and i say but like that but thanks to hanging out with kim and now knowing how to do those price reductions i got nine dollars and 87 cents off this to date and i'm still not at my 30 days so who knows it may go down a little bit lower so started at 15.99 nine dollars 87 cents off it's got like that just kind of the old style little claps like that inside you got the lining and it also came with this chain here and these little doohickeys right here to make it a crossbody or a shoulder bag so i just thought this would be really nice for some of my dresses that i can wear this with i got a couple of other colors too so looking forward to showing those with you Alrighty, and then my quest to find some some dupes. I have no idea what this one was. I saw somebody open this and they said it was I forgot what they said it was, but they said it was pretty much the same as the regular one. So it's Libre, but I don't know if that's really what it is. This came to me. I had this and a lip gloss that were in their own little bags and the bag was really squishy. So anyway, when I opened it up, the perfume had leaked out of it. So this was pretty, pretty messy. It was wrapped in plastic. Everything was contained. And what had happened is that this cap must have come off in transit and maybe getting bounced around or whatever. So a few of it came out in here. It does have these little gold flecks in there too and it's got this little design that's that's glued on so you would think it would go like this so if you know what this is i know i heard the name and she said it was the same as the original anyway right now it just kind of smells like uh the alcohol but it does have a nice scent behind it so looking forward to seeing what this is the dupe of I'm dropping things left and right. So anyway, this was, again, that perfume. It, alcohol has dried down, so it does have a really, really nice scent. Again, it's got those gold flakes in here. So if you know what the uh, original is, I would love to know what that is. And again, this was $7.19, so I'm sure it is a much less expensive than the original. 
Alrighty, so the next dupe that I got was for a uh, lip oil, and this uh, they say is the dupe for the NYX lip oil. Now again, this was packaged in the same box as the perfume that leaked out. This, the cap was also twisted off. This all leaked in here as well. Um, again, I haven't used it, but you can see how much is missing from this one. So this is Jalo Jojo. And it's a slip oil. And again, they say it's the dupe for the NYX, which is supposed to be really, really good. This was $1.99. Um, but hold on to your shorts, ladies. Or your pantyhose. Yeah, thanks again to Kim from Hanging Out with Kim. Got it right again. Um, yeah, just had a couple of price reductions since I got it. Altogether, the credits on this. Are you ready? It was $1.00. 41 so a dollar 99 and I got a dollar 41 off kind of makes up for the missing oil so if this is good I will definitely buy this again even if I don't get any cash back or rebates or price reductions on it a dollar 99 is a really good price for that all right so you know I've been having some fun with my Timu wigs right so the ones that I had before that I had for you, you know like my Halloween um, costumes things like that I usually just uh, put the tissue paper back inside the inside of the wig wrapped it up tight in the netting that came with it put it in the plastic bag that it always came with and just put it with my Halloween costumes but anyway now that I've decided that I'm having fun with wigs so the ones that I'm not wearing all the time like the really the unicorn one like the green the blue things like that I do the same things with them is that I put the tissue paper back in to get the shape in I wrap it up tight in the netting that comes with it I put it back in the plastic bag and I put it in one of those big bags that I got from Timu but you know then I this ones that I want to wear um, that I'm wearing more and more so and I thought even if I go through that bag and maybe on a Saturday or Sunday night when I'm trying to pulling what I'm going to be wearing or what videos I'm going to do um, then I'll just kind of pull them out so I got these little things I got six of these and they're li these little hangers this thing folds down that you put the uh, the wig in it's got this little thing right here the way they showed it they had three of them kind of hang in together and I thought well this would be good for the ones that I'm going to be wearing you know and I can hang them up on the shower rod in the guest uh, bathroom so I got six of these they were a dollar fifty seven each and yeah they don't fit on the uh, I forgot the one we have in there is like a wide type bar it doesn't fit there so I will have to figure out a plan B for where I'm going to put those and if I can pick these up without dropping them again like I did a few minutes ago so I've got one here and then I've got another one right there hanging so whether I maybe maybe I put them on like I've got this clothes rack in the laundry room that you kind of put your the three bags that you kind of sort your things in that you're going to wash or if you're lazy like me maybe that's where your clean clothes really go <laughs> yeah so but anyway that's got a rod on top so it might go there so they may might end up in the laundry room the ones that I'm going to be wearing so we will figure that part out later but for a dollar fifty seven for and I got each and I got six of them so we will see how that goes they have other methods too so we will see what is the best one to store them alrighty so then I got two clothes two dresses so the first one that I got I just thought I saw it and I thought you know this is going to be good for when I'm in the mood for a margaritas or and you know when it's not like the day of the dead or Cinco de Mayo just something colorful for like sangria or for the margaritas anything like that so anyway this dress was twelve dollars and nine cents and it's off the shoulder sometimes I have trouble with and again the front of it it's got all these pretty flowers so we've got black it's a nice stretchy material it's got the invisible zipper in the back and then these bright colored flowers right here it just has a regular waistline and then it's kind of like on the idea of the mermaid so it kind of sits kind of tight it goes to the knee and then flares out with all these flowers and that big ruffle and then that ruffle is a little bit longer in the back I almost knocked my hat off so for twelve dollars and nine cents I just thought that would be just kind of like a fun dress for wine diaries things like that 
Alrighty, and again that was $12.09. This next dress is back to my black and white theme because I think that's kind of just a fun thing. It's a floral in the in the front and it's just a plain black in the back. It's uh, got this one shoulder thing. I know I'm going to have to kind of modify that to sit right. And then, so I think it's, this is on the shoulder here and then this goes like this. And then again we've got the flowers and the sleeve is kind of, attached to the dress so we will have to see how to squeeze into this so anyway this was eight dollars and 47 cents and again thanks to that price reduction i get 60 cents uh price reduction off that so again just kind of fun so yeah i'm going to go play with a strap that's not adjustable so i know i'm going to have to kind of modify it a bit and um yeah so we will put this one on and we will be right back Alrighty, so I'm back. I just had to adjust that a little bit. I could probably have bring it up a little bit more and then tack it down. So again, we've got kind of like the little almost off the shoulder. I think if, if, if this was down lower, this would be falling off. And again, this would be something I've got my fascinator on right here. I left this necklace on because I switched out to this short wig. And again, this would go perfect with this little bag, whether I used it like this, like this, or took out the little shoulder strap. And this is what the dress looks like. It's really, so it's like the seam is right here, and then the rest of it is just your arm, but it is tacked in. Um, probably if you did have something fancy to go to and you wanted it customized, I'm sure a tailor could kind of maybe make this a little bit more of a custom fit to be a perfect fit. They do have quite a different um, styles and patterns in this that I saw. So it is a fun little outfit to wear to a garden party or anything like that. And of course, fascinators just help make it fun. And again, with a little bag, it would be a perfect little night out dress or a wine diary dress. I know. So anyway, we've got the uh, last one to go. So I will be right back. Alrighty, so anyway, I had to put this fun wig back on and of course just changed out my earrings and my necklace and I'm ready to Not siesta. I'm ready to have a fiesta. Yes, I need a margarita in this hand, please So anyway again, it's off the shoulder. It's got the invisible zipper up the back. It's got this right here It's a little crisp right here. So that's going to help it hold its shape We've got, of course, it's nice form fitting and then down at the knee and then it kind of goes out like a little mermaid effect. And again, this little bag would be a great little bag to wear with it. So that was everything that was in my Timu Tuesday for this week. So anyway, I've got more things on order. I've got more things that I haven't unbagged yet. I've got things that I'm kind of grouped together to maybe try to keep it a little shorter maybe like 10 things at a time with just a few try-ons and yeah so I'm loving this little bag so I have to thank Sue for reviews with Sue for giving me the idea of the handbags like I said I've got a couple of ones but you know why not have something fancy and again a big shout out to hanging out with Kim without watching that video and paying attention because you know sometimes you watch videos but you don't always pay attention I try to pay attention. Sometimes I'm just too poor to pay attention. But anyway, she explained how to do the price reductions and get that money back. And yeah, but this was like an amazing, amazing buy. I, yeah, and everything else has just been so much fun. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to spend with me. I'd love to hear what your favorite items that you are getting from your Timu hauls. Again, looking forward to hearing more on some really great dupes for perfumes and um, how many of you are really considering getting wigs now I know it's so much fun I remember 60s probably would have been the 60s mid 60s um, my mom had bright bright red bright red frizzy hair and very light-skinned I'm dark compared to everybody else in my family and I remember her hair oh my god it was so bad we were going down to Florida to visit my grandparents on my dad's side and um, she was like my hair is cannot take it and she got a wig but I remember the wig it was like rubber inside and 
I just remember her just saying it was so hot, it was so uncomfortable that she said, you know what, I'm just going to deal with my frizzy hair. These kind of wigs, you don't have to. They're like lacy. They're really breathable. They're comfortable. You don't even realize after a while that you, you've had the, you have them on. I mean, yeah, really, really fun. Let me know if you are considering getting some of these wigs or if you like, no, 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 I can't do it or whatever so anyway love to hear it so and yeah just loving these outfits i mean they're not the things i get aren't everyday outfits i mean i don't i don't really need anything so for me it's things to get for fun it's fun to just have kind of like a costume or kind of like woo it's out there you know for doing wine diary videos and things like that that's that's what i like to do these days so for me it's just a lot of fun not spending a lot of money and yeah just having fun doing it so anyway i hope you guys leave your comments hope you give my videos a thumbs up i got that ring on right here and yeah i can't wait to hear about your hauls and some of the other things that you guys are doing and i want you to just go out have a fabulous fabulous day have fun life is too short to sit and worry all the time you need to go out and have some fun so anyway take care everyone stay safe be kind be happy enjoy life have some fun love you guys so much and we will see you in our next video bye bye